Starlink is so much faster than older satellite ISPs like HughesNet, but there are trade-offs to using low Earth orbit. The big advantage of geosynchronous satellites, you only need three satellites to cover the whole Earth. Because the Earth is a sphere and you put the satellite kind of way out here and it can almost see half the Earth. The other thing about them is that because they're orbiting the Earth at the exact speed the Earth is rotating, they appear to not move from the sky. So you can point a dish right at them. So you can get really great performance out of a fairly cheap dish. With low Earth orbit, you end up needing hundreds, thousands of satellites if you're trying to do really high bandwidth stuff, they're just whizzing by. So you can't point an antenna at them. They need to use phased arrays. If you look at that dish that Starlink gives you, it's not actually a dish. It's an array of over 1,200 little omnidirectional antennas that they then use software to combine the signals to make them emulate being a dish that's following the path of the satellite. Man. Multiple inputs, multiple outputs. So why use low Earth orbit? Latency. The low Earth orbit satellites are only a couple hundred miles up where the geosynchronous orbit ones are 26,000 miles. They're 100 times closer. When you bounce a message off a satellite, you're limited by the speed of light. But when you go geosynchronous, even at the speed of light, that takes 120 milliseconds. That sounds so terrible. But then you have to bounce the signal back to the base station on Earth, and whoever you sent the message to answers you. It takes 120 milliseconds to get back to the satellite, another 120 milliseconds to bounce off. You're at half a second, and then there's the latency of going across the internet and doing whatever you need to do. So there's just no physical way for these geosynchronous satellites to ever get their latency down to 500 milliseconds. So stuff like gaming, video calls, they're a problem. 500 milliseconds, that makes people trying to do a video call keep interrupting each other by accident. And you can't play most online games with half a second ping. Not if you want to win. We have more satellite discussions, so check the linked video.